Yes, yes I am. I am Geralt of Rivia. Thank you. Uh, hey everybody, this is Blood and Wine. Uh, got a lot of really good suggestions on a couple of things that we could do next, and uh, my own personal inclination was to go this route as well. Uh, we're gonna try and find some of these diagrams to upgrade our gear. Um, there's a bunch of different Grandmaster sets available. I'm I really prefer the the woven gear, both the look and and some of the benefits that we get. Um, so I'm gonna go and look for this stuff, and I think we're probably gonna run into some trouble along the way. So. Um, from here, we're gonna jump over to somewhere close by. Looks like down here. We could head in through Trastamara Hunting Cottage, I suppose. Yeah, let's do that, shall we? Hope you guys are doing well. Thank you for all the, uh, support on this. This has been really fun. I, I just love getting back into the Witcher world, you know? It's like... I just don't get sick of it. It's awesome. Okay, where's Roach and why is he not coming to me? There he is. Or she. Whoa! Yeah, seriously, whoa. Okay. Go to the camp. This is not where we want to be. Remember all these spoons? That was awesome. She now is living with us. <laughs> Oddly enough. It's fine, Rome. Okay. You know what? You make your own path in life. That's what we do. There's no reason you can't as well. Oh, I can already see some ruins here, I imagine. That was a betting man. Oh, ruins, yeah. Actually. Scholar's pitched camp here. Should look around. Okay. Give me something. Here we go. A journal. Logbook of the archaeological expedition under the guidance of Isabelle Duchamp. Our excavation is underwritten by Oxenford Academy. Its goal is to study the ancient elven ruins at Termes and subsequently locate and find a way into the underground chambers beneath them using the purple ruby of Aid Ginvale. March 26th. We have arrived in Toussaint, one of the many trifling little realms in the Nilfgaardian Empire. Our journey took place without incid... I guess incident. Uh, Master Tylan Sale, a local elf, advised us against entering the ruins. As a precaution, we've hired a witcher. We've pitched camp and conducted preliminary reconnaissance. Something in the quarreling continues. The witcher advises us to end the expedition, and someone has yet again brought up that canard about our ancient curse. The entrance to the underground chamber is protected by a barrier. We must await the witcher's return. He is to use the purple ruby to... They were scholars. Grant entrance. Should have guessed the passages inside were blocked for a reason. Good thing they didn't try to go in there without a witcher. Okay. Good news is... We just happen to be a witcher. So... Whoa. Okay. Just practicing. Am I to assume that this place of power should draw from it? Oh, we haven't seen a place of power forever. We gotta, we gotta figure out a way to get in there. Might be underneath. Knight Errant's blinders. Are these any better than what we have? I would doubt it. Uh, fear level of 60. Here we've got 60, so it's the same. So let's actually switch it up a bit. Okay, so it must be underneath as well. Is 
Is this a separate? Oh, there's two. Okay, so hold on now. Now that we know the place of power is over here. I definitely want to find our way in. bunch of rings that we can sell. Oh, look, there it is. Do some Ducal Guard Captain Boots? Sure. More importantly... Nice. And a Quensine boost. I'll happily take that. been so afraid of boars and wolves. Hello. Just instantly kill me. Come on. Some of the scaling that they do I think is a little bit weird because like everything is so strong. I guess that that is kind of the point, it's just... Sleep. Okay. Can I avoid the wolves? Place of power. Should draw from it. Just that. Ran away pretty far. Does it really need to be this dark out here? I do see a path. Yeah, here we go. Oh, portals. Good times. Good times. Purple ruby. George Herbert's letter. Dear Hadawiga, you are absolutely correct to advise against this tourney. Why did the Dean of Archaeology entrust this leadership to the hands of this quadroon? Who found the Violet Ruby of Ed Genville, me or her? You must know the Witcher has returned after all. The Ruby removed the barrier as I held it would from the start and allowed him to explore the interior. Can you believe the Witcher almost convinced that Duchamp to return to town to hire additional guards? We don't know what dangers are in store for us. Now there's someone who knows how to pad his billable hours. Duchamp took to that idea, recalling the tale about the tomb being cursed. Yet, I convinced the company not to put any stock in fairy tales. We must hurry, I said, for what if someone beats us to it and robs the elven treasury first? Because as you know, according to my translation, the most precious can only mean one thing, the lost treasure of King Divithoff. Soon it shall be ours. Later addendum partly obscured by bloodstains. <laughs> the witch was right. We should never have gone in there. That is an accursed place. I barely managed to escape, crawl out, and take the ruby. The portal has closed. I am safe, but the others. The others have died, but we have the ruby, which means we're going to get in here. It's Magic good for barrier. Us. Got a bad feeling, damn it. Place the ruby here. something. Whoa! Vargas! Okay, wait. Vargas, I'm pretty sure are necrophages. 
I'm wrong once again. Cursed ones? Not sectoids. They're specters. Right, okay. Let's go with a little specter oil then, shall we? So we've got a bunch of different ways we can go here. Oh, this was actually... Okay. Let's try the door. Let's just see if it's going to prohibit us. It's probably locked. We're not taking tons of damage. Right, we did see those red bodies earlier. I didn't investigate them. Here's another one. A witcher brought the ceiling down to bury his foes. Ended up burying himself too. Oh, hello. Okay, so I definitely have to go back and check those other ones now.
King Divithath, here lies our father. He died so that others may live. Okay. Satchel looks like it belonged to a witcher. Nice. Well, there's all the diagrams. Okay, suppose I shouldn't be surprised Master, Master Tyen Sale asked such a steep price to forge Grand Master armor. No other craftsman in the world is equal. I tried to tell wise old Vesemir what he gave me would barely be enough for one silver sword. I trekked halfway across the world to get here from Kaer Morin, and for what? Eh, gonna have to look around for some work. Today, Tyen Sale introduced me to the leader of an arc something uh, back but in the end we reached a deal check the area out and it seems calm enough though my medallion did buzz in a few spots near the ruins that's when I why I told him to pitch a camp a bit further away from the main entrance who the blazes knows what could be living inside they've also mentioned something about a curse so I guess I should expect wraiths Vargas maybe damn it should have asked for more tomorrow we start exploring okay so we have the diagrams now. We just need to find somebody that can make it. Master, master, master. Yeah, there we go. I remember the guy. Oh, that's a really convenient place to put this stuff. Yeah, so here were the bodies that I wanted to check before. Perhaps no relevance. Just other explorers. Okay, so all in all, uh, pretty straightforward, I suppose. Let's, can we rest until daytime? Is it safe here? Safe enough. Run, hey Roach. Roach. We're gonna ride this one out. Whoa! Hold on. Yeah, let's get into this here. We'll throw on our regular precautions. Get me off! Those freaking arrows. Come on! I'm gonna actually go for the archers first. Circle him! Oh, that could have been close. Bat move. <laughs> They're bleeding out. Oh shit, it's so loud. Like, so strong! You guys never seen this before? is even trying to help. You can sense bad vibes. That'll do, pig.
Oh, what do we got here? Some diagrams, steel sword, some books, formula. Wow. Let's read this journal. Um, every day I regret what I said then. How could I have been so foolish? Why did I not agree to become her assistant? Fie upon you, base ambition. Oh, Isabel, forgive me. Enough in action. I'm off to Beauclair. If I find you alive, Isabel, I will fall to my knees and plead forgiveness. And if, if you're gone, enough of this wallowing in self-pity time to get to work. You've, I've chosen the most talented and hardworking of my students, and for my assistant, I have named my most clever adjunct, Philip Borut. The Academy Chancellery has accepted the plan for our expedition. We need but collect our equipment, then hit the road. Unbelievable. Philip had the audacity to point out to me that eating egg salad sandwiches while traveling in a closed carriage is poor manners. What arrogance. And to think I prized him above all my other adjuncts. I could not have imagined a worse start to an eight-week journey. Stuck together by sticky substance like mayonnaise? Uh, I hope so. We've arrived. I fear entering these ruins. I fear what I shall find there. I think I lack the strength to face the truth. The Im That impertinent upstart, Philip Borat, is driving me completely mad. He's accused me of idleness and indecision. How dare he hurl such insults in the presence of other members of our expedition. He does not understand who my beloved Isabel was, who she is to me. I do not wish to. I cannot accept the truth. I'm off, alone at the moment, for I do not wish them to see when I find. I will begin my searching, or by searching the ruins of the temple abuting the river. Okay, these ones we'll hold on to. For many years, it was erroneously believed slizzards were simply wyverns in the highest stage of development. One scholar whose completion of the academic course of study must have been the result of no small miracle, heatedly defended the point of his view in a scientific work whose title I shall mercifully withhold. His main line of reasoning was an absurd and completely off-the-mark parallel drawn between the developmental cycles of the slizzard and the purest brassicae, also known as the cabbage butterfly. A slizzard claimed the author is nothing but a fully mature wyvern that has developed fire glands. Utter rubbish. Let it be known once and for all that Charles von Lynn is a filthy fob toodle. Fop doodle and an uneducated knucklehead. A slizzard does not by any means the same beast as a wyvern. Okay. I could have told him. Go, that, go. Obviously. Okay, Roach. Get us where we need to be, my friend. I don't know what kind of path you're taking here, but it's questionable. I think I'm just gonna, I'm taking control. Stay away from the cows. Stay left. This is cool in here. Oh, it is a cemetery up there. Kind of off the beaten trail here, but. or beaten path. Whichever. It's nice to go for a ride like this sometimes instead of just jumping here. The Duchy as a whole suffers from a disco. Deadly snaps! My back aches on the No, don't fall! Oh, I saw that coming. Roads route in here, but it's fine. Finally made it to the point. Appearances deceive, which, uh... This is the guy, uh, the guy we're going to see. He's the one who told us about this stuff, I believe. He was like, if I could just get diagrams and I can do it. Greetings. 
I hope your search goes well. Generally, yeah. Uh, we found something. Managed to find something already. Wonderful. I shall draft a copy. This is good. This at last will earn me the title of Grandmaster. I thank you, Witcher. Okay, so now... He's given us some money, which is good. Would you craft something for me? Of course. This stuff's probably going to be very expensive, I imagine. Or we might be... Yeah, we're missing stuff. So what are we missing? Superior woven armor. Do we not have that? Okay, what am I wearing right now? Hold on. Farewell. Good luck on the path. Thanks. Okay, we're wearing mastercrafted woven armor. Um, maybe we have to not be wearing it. Greetings. Would you craft? Of course. Okay, so let's see. Yeah, okay, so this is fine. We need Slizzard Hide, which looks like we can buy. And Enrich Dimeridium Plates. Oh my god. Let's see if we can find them in here. Dimeridium ingots. Here's the plates that we need to make from ingots. That we need to make from dimeridium ore. Okay. But then we're short on dark steel ingots. We can make a bunch of these. So we need plates, which come from ingots, which come from ore, correct? Yeah. Meteorite silver ingots. They all go together somehow. This is only, we're gonna be, we're gonna be short on this for sure. Oh, and this actually enriched, so I think I built the wrong one. I need enriched dimeridium ore. There's an ingot. We have one of them. There's the plates. Oh, it's because I was looking at the... I think I was looking at the Master Crafted before, not the Grand Master. I think that's why it wasn't showing. Um, so we need two plates. I need one more. And we would need Slizzard Hide, which I guess I could buy. So I need two more ingots, which means I need two more of these. Or a calcum ore. Which I can make from green gold. That's crazy. It's probably a lot easier if I just buy the stuff that we need. I don't want to be in the crafting. Here we go. 
I could buy this, but it's very expensive. Um, the, the Slizzard Hide we could buy. We could afford one of them. But, uh, yeah. Okay. This is going to take a little bit of cash. Hola. Which I guess is fine. Uh, we also need Slizzards. Slizzard Hides. Farewell. Good luck on the path. All right, so um, I'm definitely open to advice on our best path here to get these things built. I'm thinking just paying for them is probably the easiest way. Uh, let's just see. I'm actually going to mark this area so we know where he is. Removing your... Ailments of the skull. Okay, what else do we have going on here? Um, Wine Wars Belgard? Yeah, we could go here. We could go visit the estate since we had just finished recently. Let's go back there while things are still fresh. Let's go! Now, obviously, we did learn about slizzards a little bit um, from the book that we read, but we haven't seen one. So we could hunt for those materials, or we could just pay for them. What's more important, time or money? In my opinion, time is way more important than money. Okay, so this looks like Belgard here. All right, I think we'll take a break. When we come back, we'll uh, pick up right from uh, Belgrad, which is really nice, actually. So, uh, yeah, wish me luck, guys. And if you have any input on how to best get the money or uh, re required, I guess, crafting components for the master crafted um, gear or the grandmaster gear, then let me know. See you next time. Bye.